Bakers, welcome back to another video. I know I haven't posted um, for like three weeks, but I started 7th grade and I'm super excited because it's super fun and um, even online it's pretty easy because I have amazing teachers and so I haven't much, had much time to upload, but since I have a free period right now because I already did the homework, I'm going to show you guys how to make the funnest and quickest and most delicious dessert ever for these school days. It's also somewhat healthy. It doesn't, like, the only thing that's in it is a little bit of sugar. I'm not quite sure how much, but it's only a little bit. Um, so it's pretty healthy and it's delicious. I actually haven't tried it yet, but the reviews are really good. And I just want to say that I don't come up with my own recipes usually. I do sometimes and I'll tell you if I do, but I usually don't come up with my own recipes. And so I usually am getting it off the internet and you can't really trust the internet, but it does have good reviews and I do trust good reviews. Um, sometimes it's not true, but sometimes it is. Um, yeah. Let's get started making some lemon popsicles. First step is we're going to be making our cold water because I don't know about you guys, but I don't have a filtered water spigot or spout or whatever that makes cold water. It's just the water that you get, you get. It's never warm, but it's also never like ice cold. So I kind of have to make my own. And so I'm going to take this bowl of three fourths a cup of water it's right there. Going to use that water in this bowl and I'm going to put it in the freezer because in the time that we're making this, the rest of it, it's not gonna freeze like ice. It's just gonna get really cold. So we're gonna put this in the freezer and I will so tell you the next I'm so incredibly sorry, but I already added in the last two ingredients because I am too much of a perfectionist and I did film it but I just didn't like the way I like talked and looked and everything. So you didn't see it. But technically there is one half cup of sugar and one half cup of lemon juice in this bowl right here. And that's what you're going to put in there too. If you're following along, this is a half cup measurement. This is how much you're supposed to put in of both lemon juice and sugar. And I just didn't show it because I'm too much of a perfectionist. So, I'm gonna go get my whisk, which is the tool I'm going to be using for this, and I will be right back. Hi. <sighs> As you can tell, I'm a little bit frustrated because this is the uh, third time filming this part of the video because I just can't do it right. As you can see, I'm already whisking. Um, I've been whisking for like five minutes through all of my tries, but the point is, I'm whisking together the half cup of lemon juice and the half cup of sugar, and um, I'm almost done with it. You're gonna whisk it until the sugar is dissolved, and I'm pretty sure that's right now. And so, um, in my last two clips, I was just talking about how um, people don't give themselves enough credit for talents, and I'm trying to give myself more credit for being a good baker because I am a good baker, like not trying to be rude or anything, or like conceited, but I am a good baker and I just wanna give myself more credit for that. So I'm going to try to do that in my next videos because I know I've said like I'm super awkward and I might not be that good at baking. Like I said, all that stuff in my last videos. I'm trying to get, I'm gonna try to give myself more credit um, during these videos. So yeah, I'm gonna get my water out of the freezer so that we can add this to this and this and blah. And I'll show you the next step afterwards. So I have my bowl of three quarters of a cup of cold water. And I'm just going to pour it into my mixture of lemon juice and sugar. And guess what? That's the popsicle mixture. I know if you made it too, like I'm looking at it and it looks like yellow water, um, like a dark yellow water, but it's fine because this is supposed to turn into delicious popsicles. And in the photos, they were like kind of clearish yellow. And I actually, that doesn't seem too far from this. I don't know if you can tell, it might just like water on camera, but it actually looks pretty clear yellow when you like take it out on the whisk. So I'm gonna go get my popsicle molds and we're gonna do the next step. All right, so I got out my popsicle molds and I filled up these popsicles. They're gonna be beautiful. 
I really do think they're going to turn out really good. Um, these are what they look like. I'll show you a better look right this now. This is what the finished product looks like. Well, not finished. I still have to freeze it. But this is what the close to finished product looks like. And the way these molds work is when they're done freezing, you flip them upside down and this up here is the handle and you take off this plastic part and you have a popsicle. So I'm gonna let these freeze for three hours and I'll be back when they're done.